The search is on for a hit and run driver who struck a Miami Dade officer. And let's get right out down to local 10's Cody Weddle live in West Miami Dade with the details for us. Cody. Calvin and Nicole, a Miami Dade police cruiser heavily damaged in this crash. Let's take a look here. This is at Southwest Street and Coral Way. You can see again that that uh, police cruiser heavily damaged. Let's take a look at some video that we shot just a few minutes ago. Miami Dade police are telling us that this was a hit and run crash. This crash occurred here at this intersection. This officer was then transported to Jackson Memorial Hospital's Ryder Trauma Center. Now the suspect in this case continued down Southwest 24th Street. Let's take a look at some more video. This suspect uh, then got out of his car. He fled on foot, uh, took off eastbound um, through a park. Police were then able to track this person down. Uh, they went to an address where he was registered and they did make an arrest. Let's come out here live again and take a look again at this uh, police car uh, that has been heavily damaged. We're standing by for more information from Miami Dade Police about the condition of this officer. Of course, we actually have Miami Dade Police here right now to give us some more information. Um, what can you tell us about the condition of that officer? What we know right now is that the officer was transported with gladly non life threatening injuries and he's being treated for those injuries as we speak and thankfully uh, this officer will be able to go home to his family today in spite of uh, the cowardly actions of the subject who crashed into our officer and fled the scene. What can you tell us about the suspect who has been arrested? We know he fled on foot. Uh, you tracked him down at a residence. Tell us about that. Well, I want to hand over major kudos to our investigators who are able to uh, determine exactly where the subject may be staying and uh, head to an address where they were able to locate him. Why? What was going on uh, before this crash? Were police uh, pursuing this vehicle? The information that we have right now is that there was no pursuit prior to this. Our officer was actually off duty and uh, traveling to an unknown destination when this vehicle crashed into him. Our officer was attempting to make a left-hand turn. This vehicle was traveling east in a, uh, in a straight in a lane and collided with this police car, badly damaging it and injuring our officer. And this person did not stop to render aid, did not check on the status of our officer, Instead, he decided to continue on and bail out of his vehicle into a park full of children and families that were uh, going about their day with extracurricular activities. And um, luckily, our officer is okay, and the subject is going to be held accountable for his actions. Okay, Andre Martin with the Miami Dade Police Department. Thank you so much for that latest information. We'll, of course, continue to follow this. We're standing by for even more information from police. We'll bring, bring you that tomorrow morning. For now, we're live here in West Miami-Dade. I'm Cody Weddle, Local 10. Good